So we have a new update for Winget UI. It's version 1.6.0. And finally, with this update, we have a support for Chocolatey. Now, this app supports all the major Windows package managers. Winget, Scoop, and chocolate. Winget UI is like essential app for me because using this I can look for the softwares and download them and most importantly I can get the updates for the softwares. I mean you don't really need to use Winget UI to use all these package managers. You can simply use command line and if you're someone who really likes to use terminal to install apps just like you do on Linux I mean go for it but I really like the GUI. So basically the Winget UI is a GUI for all these package managers so yeah it's 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 like one of the coolest software that i have in my system actually <laughs> yeah in my opinion winget ui is even better than the microsoft store because winget ui has more x86 apps compared to the microsoft store it's not like the microsoft store is completely useless it's still useful but the fact that winget ui has more softwares that makes Winget UI better. That's all. <laughs> yeah. I don't really need to give you guys a tutorial how to use this, but still, uh, let's install one or two applications. So if you are seeing this for the first time, maybe it will be useful and you'll have an idea what's up with this app. All right. So let's say I want to install this app, Virus Total Uploader. So we can just simply install it or I can get a info before I install it, which is always a good thing to do. Check the info of the app before you actually, you know, blindly uh, install. So it will give you uh, info and it will give you, you know, homepage of the actual software. You can go there and check that if this is legit or not. So something like that. So, yeah. So for me, it looks like this is a safe app. To install so i'm gonna install it now it's just gonna install that app in background i can also see the command line output just like that and it looks like the app is already installed some of you guys may be wondering can i find all the pc softwares not really but you can find almost all the popular and most used applications yeah uh, even the chat gpt app is here somehow so i didn't knew that there is a chat, chat gpt app so i'm gonna go into show info just to make sure that it is legit so it looks like it is a github uh, you know project and there is a software which you know lets you use the chat gpt i mean it's a software so yeah <laughs> looks like it's legit i can just install it let's say something difficult uh, scrcpy it's here even the scrcpy plus is here which is actually much better than the scrcpy it just provides the gui for scrcpy it's still a scrcpy just gui really cool app uh, i have made a video on that too so yeah you can expect to get almost all the most used and well-known applications in here and on top of that you can get the updates for them yeah <laughs> even the chrome is there i think i'm just repeating myself at this point but yeah just expect to get almost all the softwares in here that's all i can say and the best part is that you can get the software updates too so which is really cool so i use CapCut. <laughs> look at that there is a update for CapCut too yeah i think that's it hope you enjoyed it if you still have any questions or have any suggestions for me you can always do the comment and we can have some chit chat in the comment section too i think i forgot to mention this that winget ui is also a free and open source project at github you can go there and download it from here yeah uh, it's the coolest software that i have and you should also use them unless you like to use terminal so that's it. Hope you enjoyed it. I will see you in the next one. Take care of yourself and have fun. Bye-bye.